Hey, hey guys, so I want to talk to you guys about recall training with that. Uh, just recall leads training. What this is really about is communication. Recall kind of comes along with it. So this is something that's going to be huge for him around the house and just kind of in the yard. So this just gets him used to having some space, having a longer line. So I want you guys to kind of take note of this. I always start with this in my backyard with almost every, other, every young dog I work with. Um, and what this entails is just moving together, listening together. I'm going to bring out Savannah too because um, I think she needs some of this training as well, um, but not on the leash. So, and I want to make it a little harder for him. Come on. Good hands are getting the boy. So, I want him to start doing stuff without treats. But he's got one right there. Come on, buddy. Good. Start backpedaling, getting it moving. Good. Keeping it exciting. You want to keep it exciting for a young dog, otherwise you're going to lose their attention. So work, my friend. He's great at the back door. He's doing really well with door manners. He's just putting his paws up on it. So. We got a bit of a scorcher today, so we're gonna be whew, coming in and out in a little shorter bursts. But you see this right here? Good. So let's get him into a sit, a wait, a touch. Good. So these things I'm sure that he learned a little bit in his previous training, but I also really want to uh, hone in how important it is to keep up with it to mix things up. So he's asking right now, I'm ignoring, I'm keeping him in my bubble, touch, good. Good deal. Sorry about that. Come on. Hey, so here, nose, eyes, ears is gonna come into play now. So he is sniffing at something at the table here. Right here. It's right there. Oh my gosh. Little stuff like that drives me bonkers. Come on. So nose. Come on. Eyes. Yes. Ears. Boom. Distraction averted. Okay. So you see a little bit about this recall leash train. This is something I like to do. Sorry. It's the way I have my phone set up. Ugh. So I want to show you some stuff. You see this right here? That's what we don't want. Hey! So see right now, she knows that she's uninhibited. Sit. She knows that she doesn't have a leash on. She doesn't have a slip lead on. She doesn't have anything. So she's going to run the show. So what I want to do is I want to stay in control. And I'm going to do it through Saxon. And hopefully not having to pick this camera up again. Because the way I set my phone up, it's causing me way more annoyance. So see right here, see look, I turn my back, that's when that happens. So the treats are good, but they're really not a bargaining trick right now. They're creating new habits for him. Okay, so I'm not just saying like, hey, don't get on the bed and I'll give you a treat. This is, hey, this is what we're doing out here instead. So see now, look at her. 
speed, how that stops, that barking stops. Tacky, touch, good. And it's all because of that $7 recall leash. So get one of these on Amazon. This is huge. Two to five to 10 minutes doing this since it's so hot and we have so much sunshine today. Good, good boy. And this is how I just bond with them more. This is how I develop a trust, develop a sense of direction for him outside. So now let me take the leash off. Let me take the harness off and let's just kind of see what happens. See where he's at. I'm so sorry. Hey, no, no, that's very rude. That's a very rude thing to do. All right. Buddy, buddy, buddy. I, I, I am so sorry about this. You do not want to see my sweaty hand. There we go. All right, so let's see what we got here now. Considering that you were naughty and got my glasses today. All my backwards turn. Oh, so we got more guests that came out to play. Okay, that's fine. We got the whole crew here to end this lesson. And Savannah loves it. No, Zoe. No, come on. Daddy, sit. 